Okay, here's the article I came across here. Uh, reviewing destined for war. No. Let's see, it's what they want me to think that more edible. Um, here. Uh, that's because that's how they, they make it inevitable. Um, because they want other resources and things like that. It's like I've said, and a lot of said, it's just them vying for which faction is going to take over the one world government because that one world government has been here for a long time. People just have not saw that. You know, it's via trade. I've said that a lot, too. It is via trade. Um, it goes back even further than the, the East India Company. Um, way, way further. Um, and these same people has been perpetrating this shit for centuries, thousands, years. You know, who, who knows how long. Um, and here it's saying, you know, look. They continue to roll out new platforms and capabilities, you know, the military crap. <laughs> new ways to kill people. Uh, population control there. Uh, like I said, it's the grand chessboard. Uh, this is it. The world is their playgrounds, how they see it. They can do whatever they want with it to us and everything on it. So. Anyway, I'd say, but uh, it's just more or less, like I said, it's saying, oh, yeah, de destined for war. Uh, can America and China escape? However you say that, trap. <laughs> anyway, there. Um, it's no trap, like I said. It's, uh, it's, uh, they, they, they plan this shit years in advance. Uh, as we know, uh, anyways, that's just, just putting this out there, uh, and I'll put the link below to read, and I've got to check my stuff on the stove, shit, anyway, take care, y'all, have a great day, night, evening, morning, wherever you are, and so, <laughs> much love, peace, see us, take care.